सिद्धियो भन्दा चाहिँ ठुलो खुसी लाग्यो किनभने चाहिँ अब साह्रै दुःख भएको थियो अनि त्यो दुःख रूपले नाच गाना यहाँ त्यहाँ सबैसित बागेर बाउँदाखेरि त्यो बिर्सियो अन्त एकदम राम्रो खुसी भयो The conflicts of uh, World War One and World War Two were such massive conflicts, and over such extended periods of time, that stories not just about the Gurkhas, but about a number of British regiments grew up, and people had a real understanding of the sacrifices made by men in uniform. In June 1943, uh, Britain uh, had suffered defeat after defeat in Burma. The British forces had been fighting there for some weeks, and there had been 800 casualties in the previous eight days. The Japanese were very heavily dug in. There was an intention to have an early morning assault upon the positions, and the British needed someone to go forward to find out where those machine gun posts were. They asked for volunteers. A young Gurkha of about 22 years old stepped forward and volunteered. He asked for Hessian sacks that he could tie onto his shoes because the British Army issue boots had nails in them that creaked as he walked, and he needed to deaden that. He crept forward in the jungle and scattered all of the Japanese machine gun posts and brought back a full report. The next day they attacked. Almost all of the men were killed or seriously wounded within the first few seconds. Two of Pun, his sergeant and another man were the only ones left standing and they continued the advance. Those two other men were mortally wounded and he was left alone on the battlefield. अहिले चाहिँ दुश्मनसित मार्नु पर्छ दुश्मनलाई जित्नु पर्छ भन्ने त थियो तर उनीसित लड्दा लड्दा अब मान्छे धेरै मारिदाखेरि चाहिँ मलाई पनि त ठुलो जोस आयो म हाम्रो मान्छे सबै मारिसक्यो अब तलाई बेला म मार्ने हो भनेर चाहिँ मेरो ठुलो जोस आएको थियो and he advanced through a withering storm of bullets and took out three Japanese machine gun posts. In fact, he did not do it with a machine gun, he did it with his cookery knife because the machine gun was jammed. I मलाई चाहिँ पकड्नु लायो तर मैले चाहिँ हातमा सानो खुकुरी थियो हातमा चाहिँ खुकुरी लिएर त्यससित लगेर लाउँदाखेरि चाहिँ उसले चाहिँ खुकुरीले हानेर अनि न चाहिँ उसलाई गिरायो त्यहाँदेखिबाट फेरि अर्को पनि निक्लिएर आयो त्यहाँदेखि त्यसलाई पनि हातमा खुकुरी थियो त्यसले चाहिँ हाल्यो उसको भरमा त्यो पनि जल्यो खत्म भयो बाइसराज भन्ने थियो उसको उनले उनीको हातबाट चाहिँ दिल्लीको ठुलो परेड गरेर उसले उनीको हातबाट तबा थाराएको हो त्यस कारणले चाहिँ मलाई पनि धेरै खुसी लाग्यो कि मैले चाहिँ लडाइमा चाहिँ धेरै राम्रो काम गरेको ठुलो काम गरेको छु भनेर चाहिँ म धेरै खुसी लाग्यो त्यसले अब लडाइमा गइयो के अनि त्यो लडाइको अटेमा चाहिँ धेरै मान्छेहरू मेरो साथीमा मरे हेर्दाखेरि थुप्रो मरेको मात्रै देख्छ अनि चाहिँ 
त्यतिखेर चाहिँ मेरो मन कस्तो चाहिँ हुन्छ भनेर अहिले चाहिँ धेर हाम्रो दाजुभाइ सबै मरिसक्यो म एउटा मात्रै छ सायद म पनि मऱ्यो भनेर त सकिन्छ भनेर चाहिँ हे भगवान भनेर चाहिँ त्यति मात्रै भनेको छ